and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Video, guys. Simply going over what you need to be doing first in the Super Bowl promo. Now, the promo did just drop about an hour ago. I'm recording this. You probably won't see this to about, I'd say, about like 1, 1.30, because my other video has been up for quite a while now. I'm gonna let that video stay up for a bit. You know, you guys already know the routine with this. Now, quite a few things to do. There's obviously Super Bowl tickets, which is important for getting players. There's a lot of ways you can take advantage of those. And remember, not everything is about doing it now. It's about preparing for what's going to come next. So as you guys know, things are coming out. This promo is in three sets. So by getting things done now, nice and early, you can set yourself up a little bit nicer for later on in the promo. Now, my opinion so far, I'm not the... You can't say you're not the biggest fan of the promo yet, right? I, I like it because all your... You're basing your whole like of this promo based off of the first things drop. As you guys know, with Zero Chill, the first card drop were kind of ass. Halloween, same thing. Things have been dropped in segments and better things have come out. Just like with the Christmas, the last thing was Bo Jackson, Michael Vick, Mel Blunt, Michael Strahan. Like, that was the extent to what we got at the end. So you cannot judge a book by its cover, especially a promo like this. Now, so far, I like it, guys. But before we get into this video and I go over what you need to be doing first, make sure to go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn the notification bell, boys. Come join the family. Comment down below, Noti Gang, if you guys are here. And always smash the like button, guys. It helps the channel grow tremendously. Let's keep it going. Every like. Is an extra positive uh, load for the com our community here. So thank you guys. Let's continue on. Oh, and as you guys know, if you guys hit the like goal on today's 10:30 video, I will be doing a Steve Young gameplay. So go back there, check it out. The like goal 700. Go drop a like. Now let's get into this. So first thing I would be doing personally, you come on over to Super Bowl LIV the set, and it says right here, earn a Super Bowl hero. And then there's also the house rule. So earn a Super Bowl hero. If you have enough tickets, you can get a Super Bowl hero. So how do you get tickets? You get them from solo challenges and house rules. Now here's the important thing, right? This is what it costs to get a free 95 overall player right now. Super Bowl tickets. It costs four total tickets, which is extremely easy to get from solo challenges or house rules. Now you might be saying to yourself, right? So I can only I only need four, and that's it. It's one time. You get one Nat, Sonny Michelle, Adam Timmerman, or Clay Matthews. Now I don't think Sonny Michelle or Clay Matthews are all that great for me, but Adam Timmerman is a free 95 overall right guard, so that's solid. I'd recommend if you guys did this, depending on your team, obviously Packers theme teams, maybe Patriots, maybe Rams. But in my team, I'd probably want Adam Timmerman. It's a solid, solid choice for a top end right guard this time in Madden. Solid choice. So that's one free player. Now you might also be thinking, right, are there more Super Bowl tickets? So let's go on over. So I personally think you should start off with getting your Super Bowl tickets up. First thing you can do now, solo challenges or house rules. Solo challenge is probably a little bit easier because you can probably get through them quicker. Come over to Super Bowl. Milestones. So you get for stars, obviously. You guys already know the routine. You get one ticket, two ticket, three tickets, four tickets, five tickets, six tickets, seven tickets, eight tickets, nine tickets, ten total tickets. You get ten total tickets. Plus, you get three 82 plus Super Bowl players that could potentially be the 95s. Could just be higher overall ones. Could be some decent coins. Those are always solid choices right there. But you get ten total tickets, right? So you get ten total tickets from there. And then you come over to house rules. So remember that number. We got ten tickets. Now let's head over to seasons and we go over to house rules. I always hate this whole process it takes to get into this house rules. There we go. Two minute drill. So this gets you one Super Bowl ticket per 15 wins. So let's let's average like most people probably play between 30 and 60. So let's go with another four tickets. Let's go with two tickets, right? Most people play at least 30. So it's a quick game. Lasts literally like a minute, not even, because it's literally two minutes. Really start with a minute, 20 seconds in the game. So two tickets. So that leaves you with you have 10 from the solos and two from here. That's about 12 total tickets. At bare minimum, you get 12, in my opinion. You can get a lot more. You can honestly farm tickets all day on that uh, house rules if you really want to. Now, this set that we saw costs four total tickets. So, what does that mean? Technically, you can get three. But you cannot do that set. That set is not repeatable. So, you cannot get, like, Sonny Michelle, Clay, and Timberman. But here's a little caveat with this set that looks pretty interesting. Is that, so, you have 12 tickets, right? You used four. You got your Timberman or whoever you wanted. Next, you look over here. Additional Super Bowl Hero Nats coming soon. Additional. I'm assuming that means plural, right? So, there's a Super Bowl Past Hero Nat. There's probably gonna be a Super Bowl present hero now, which could be Tyree Kill, Travis Kelsey, Mitchell Schwartz, um, McCall Harbin already came out, maybe Sammy Watkins. So whatever cards are gonna be the 95 present players, we could potentially get those for free. So that's already two free players right there, right? That's solid. Then beyond that, there could be another set because this, po this promo is dropping in three parts. Super Bowl past, Super Bowl present. I don't know what the third part's going to be, but there's going to be a third part to this promo. So remember, 
if you guys do this right and get to 12, you could potentially get up to 395 players. So I'd recommend you get your tickets up now. So when the time comes, you can just hop in there. You don't have to go do it later. Tickets are very easy to get. The solos probably take you maybe an hour and a half, two hours. I don't really know how long they are entirely. I think some of them start like in the third quarter, fourth quarter. I don't know how many are full games, but shouldn't take you too long. And the house rules, like I said, each game is like literally a minute. It's a minute, 20 seconds. You have no timeouts. You don't switch. Like it's offense has to score. That's it. You stop them defensively. You probably won because there's no timeout. If you, if you stop them, it's game over. There's no timeouts. So that's it. There's not enough time to even waste clock or anything. It's just, it's over. So very simple to do. Now beyond that, once you get your Super Bowl tickets and everything, you can obviously start looking at the sets and stuff. Now, in my opinion, this set, I always love these sets. I'll probably make a video on this afterwards, going over all the mathematics of it. But depending on the quick sell value and everything, that'll determine what these sets are really valued at. I mean, Steve Young's awesome, right? Steve Young's a great quarterback. Guys, honestly, as far as if you guys are thinking, like, what should I pick up right now? I don't know if Clay Matthews and Sonny Michelle are the move. Clay Matthews and Timmerman are good, actually. Sonny Michelle might not be the move at running back at this point in time. But as a whole, Steve Young's a beast. He's going to probably be one of, I think in my opinion, the end game quarterbacks here are going to be Lamar Jackson, Patrick Mahomes, Steve Young, and probably, who is the fourth one? Michael Vick. Those might be the four quarterbacks at the end of the year. Oldsman Legend, Steve Young. All these cards are going to be fast, great passers. Towards the end of the year, Lamar might be the best one just based off of how fast he's going to be compared to the other ones. But, like I said, Steve Young's still great. You can get this done. You can all go buy him. He's pretty cheap. So, I'd recommend after you get your tickets, you start worrying about what you're going to pick up. I wouldn't buy... I didn't buy things right away. I want to see the price go down a little bit. There's also the random Super Bowl player, which you can exchange things for. I don't know if I recommend doing this. You're going to need Super Bowl players anyway. So, to get these, you're probably going to have to either get your free ones from the Souls you can put into there. Or, you're going to have to go ahead and open packs, which I don't really recommend either for the most part. So, beyond getting your tickets, like I said, you can get more. Remember that. It's not just about getting the 12 i think 12 is just a good thing i think if there's three parts of the promo there'll probably be three sets that's just what i'm currently thinking there could be more so you could farm them you could literally get like 100 wins and get like seven total i think it's a little it's a little more than seven you get about seven rounded right about seven tickets you can easily get from there which could leave you with almost another two on top of what you already had it just depends i don't know how many they're gonna drop we're obviously gonna have to wait but i think it's good to at least have 12 i think 12 is like a safe number you play all your solos first and then you get 30 house rules wins. Not that hard. Like I said, those house rules wins are super quick. I played one, took me real, real, real simple. Now, beyond that, remember, we do have the other parts of the promo. So as far as what to do first, like I said, I'm, I'm recommending the tickets and maybe Steve Young. I don't recommend, there's not really much else you can do beyond that at this moment in time. So I recommend, it's very simple though. I like that. I don't like when you get into the promo and there's like a hundred things to do. You get overwhelmed. You don't know where to start. You don't know what to do. Should you do this? Should you do that? Very simple. You get your tickets. You play your house rules. You play your solos. And once you get all that done, you maybe, maybe pick, maybe do the set, maybe pick up Steve Young. I'll drop all the mathematics of that in another video more than likely. And then at that point, you can worry about the next drops. So what will the next drops be? Usually this promo goes all the way up to the Super Bowl, which Super Bowl is about a week from, it's a week from Sunday, obviously. So I don't know the exact date of the Super Bowl. I forgot the exact date, but it might be February 2nd. I, it might be February 2nd, but point being here is that we pretty much have a week. I, I'd imagine that they drop this one Friday. They might drop the second part like Monday. And then they might drop like the third part like Wednesday. I don't know if there was exact dates given. I don't believe there was. So there's going to be more to do. I'll drop more videos going over as things come out. But I get your tickets now. Obviously, they're going to be useful for this promo. I think that's awesome. If we get three free players, that's a solid, solid promo. That's definitely going to be great. I really do like that. I hope that we can take advantage of this. Now, guys, that is pretty much it for the video. I think that pretty much wraps up everything. Make sure to go check out the 1030 video today. Like I said, I'm going to go over the math of the set. If the set does prove to be good and worthwhile i will make a video going over it and remember if you guys want to see a steve young gameplay make sure to go back to this morning video and if we get 700 likes on the video i will drop a steve young gameplay for you whether today or tomorrow depending on when we hit the like goal so keep that up and guys a lot more stuff's gonna be coming out here so at least it's simple you can get a few things done you can knock out the solos in one day that's perfect knock out the house rules and what you need and you're done then you can just worry about everything else that comes out you don't have to if you, if you wait now so everything comes out there's gonna be a bunch of stuff out a bunch of things to do a lot of things to use tickets out and gonna be really behind get it all done now knock on everything and you're gonna feel great when the time does come but guys that is better for the video hope you guys did enjoy if you're new to the channel make sure you're gonna blow hit that subscribe button turn the notify bell boys let's get to 18k as quickly as possible i think truthfully we're gonna hit it by tomorrow or maybe even tonight if you guys go crazy today it all really depends and make sure to comment down below if you guys need any help with anything if you guys are gonna what should you be doing first between house rules or solos i think i went over that but if you have any opinions or anything let me know down below and make sure to run that like button up can we get 300 likes in this video that'd be greatly appreciated guys let's keep it going you guys have been awesome with the support lately i greatly appreciate it let's keep grinding out guys we're gonna finish off madden strong not that it's almost over but i feel like we're pat we're in the new year now right so 
This is Madden 21 year. So we're going to go out all the way strong to the game the day this game dies. And it's, it's looking good, guys. Here's the start of our 2020 Madden year. So let's keep it going. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. Enjoy the rest of your day. Make sure to check out the other bids. I'm out. See you in the next video. Peace.